yeah we we had we had fun it was kind of like we were it was so sweet we played so many games like um uh Zach Cooperstein who was the DOP was really into games so he had like all these board games he brought with him uh he had like uh Catan that's oh. one right <laughs> and he had like werewolf and he had um playing cards um so we had a lot of um time together where we played games it was kind of like very sweet very um you know we, we we didn't go out like drinking or like clubbing or anything like that we we played games and it was very wholesome and sweet so i think what sets this movie apart from other horror movies um is that it, it's just got a fantastic script. It has a fantastic story in its center. It's really well written. Um, it has something to say, which is always kind of exciting when you're watching genre films. And it's constantly leaves you second guessing. You just don't know what's going to happen, um, which is really fun. I think it's fun to be in a film and have to constantly be trying to figure out where you are, what's going on. Um, yeah, it's fantastic. I think uh, that Tess is really relatable. She's written to be relatable. She kind of stands in for the audience throughout the film. Um, so you're going on this journey with her and she's reacting to everything that's going on around her. Um, so I can relate. Uh, I can relate a bit, probably not now, but when I was a bit younger to being trapped in, you know, bad relationships or kind of not feeling like I had agency over my life or not feeling like I had the, the confidence or the kind of assuredness in myself um, to kind of battle things alone and not feel like you, you need to be in a relationship or, or, or you need that person to kind of fall back on. It was wonderful. I was so excited. I was so excited um, to be on a film and working with Justin Long and it was really exciting. I remember telling my sister and she was like, oh my God, Justin Long, like that's so cool. You know, oh. Dodgeball and like, he's just, you know, been in so many kind of classic, amazing films. Um, so that was really exciting. And then with Zach, it was just, you know, I didn't really think about him being a first time director and he certainly didn't feel like it. There was never any moment on set where it felt like, he was struggling or he didn't know what he was doing he was fixed in like he he feels like he's been directing for a really long time it really suits him um so i just really enjoyed working with him